Hey, what's going on? This is Decide and Do 134, and I want to ask you a question. I was watching, you know, my motivational Saturday videos, like always, and uh, if you watch my video from earlier, I was having a lazy day, and, uh, you know, after that, I, I kind of got into watching some of my videos, and one of them just hit me right there, uh, and the question that I want to ask is, have you plateaued? Have you gotten to the top or gotten to where you want to and then now you're just kind of maintaining and the video which was a great one uh, and I posted on my face Facebook earlier was uh, the the well-known and re renowned uh, Notre Dame coach Lou Holtz and he talks about how the biggest regret that he has in life is he took something from nothing to something and instead of doing more he just stayed there. For nine straight years, Notre Dame went to a bowl game. And he talks about one of his biggest regrets overall was that he didn't do anything more. He's like, you know what? We took something great and we got it there and we're like, wow, this feels pretty good and we're gonna just go ahead and keep it there. On that 10th year, when they came in number two, people were like, what is going on? What's going on with Notre Dame? And obviously, you know, that's just uh, craziness in itself. But the real question is, is centered around that. Have you plateaued? Have you done everything that you wanted to do and now you've gotten to where it is that you wanted to get and now you're just kind of maintaining whatever it is? And I think a lot of us fall into that funk. We fall into, you know, if we can fall into a comfort zone when we have nothing, we'll definitely fall into a comfort zone when we have something. And if you're the, at that point where now you have something, whether that's work or life or the goals you've accomplished that you wanted to accomplish, so, and, and you've kind of gotten there, you can definitely fall into the comfort zone and those comforts of what come with you being where you are now. And I think each and every single day, and, and just like the video earlier, he talks about challenging yourself and continuing to challenge yourself and continuing to do more and go above and beyond because if you're just maintaining, you're going to look back and you're going to regret because there's still more that you could have done. There's still more that you could have given. There's still more effort and there's still more potential that you could have tapped. They could have done more. That program could have done more. They could have went further. They could have, you know, continued on and, and, Although nine years is an extremely long time for a football program to be on the top, it doesn't mean that it couldn't have been on the top for longer. They got comfortable with where they were, and that's when all of a sudden, boom, they're in the number two. And then eventually, you know, uh, they, they, they weren't any in, in the rankings anymore. And then the program that didn't fall apart necessarily, but wasn't where it was, wasn't at the caliber that it was years ago. And that's how we. Every single one of us, if we don't continue to push ourselves and we don't continue to challenge ourselves and we're up there and we've plateaued and we just go ahead and stay there and maintain, it's not going to last forever. Because if we're not trying to do new things and reinvent ourselves and continue to challenge ourselves, there's a great likelihood that you are going to go ahead and get to where it is that you were or, or wanted to be and then fall from there. So don't do that. Try every single day to do something more. Give back more. You know, I think that probably around, I don't know, for me, maybe 70, 80, you know, of these videos, I feel like I kind of just leveled off. And that's really what I'm trying to do now is to, to reinvent what I'm trying to, not reinvent altogether, but just reinvent some of the ways that I'm trying to get my message out there uh, and, and ensure that I'm not double tapping the same message that I've talked to, you know, about previously. But Watching this video earlier kind of just made that whole, especially with the lazy day that I was having this morning, kind of just thought about it and I realized, you know what, I'm that guy, I plateaued and now I have to do something more. I have to go ahead and figure something else out. And a lot of you, I'm sure of it, I'm sure of it out there, you have kind of plateaued and now you're not doing what you possibly could do. And I challenge you, I challenge every single one of you, especially, you know, if you're, if you're really behind what you want to do in life and you really are, are throwing everything that you have into it to continue to challenge yourself, continue to push, continue to drive yourself forward. Because if you don't and you just kind of hang out there, it gets lonely. You're going to get lonely real quick because what you thought was what you know full success was and you thought what achievement was and you thought all these different things they're not you know every single day in some ways we can get kicked in the gut you know i got kicked in the gut on friday and it kind of made me 
uh, think about some things differently and then life happens and you know certain things come up and you know, it just gives you that realization that you have to continue you have to continue to push you have to continue to better yourself every single day i challenge you just like i challenge myself to continue to get better continue to do things in more continue to shoot for the stars don't you know just don't be happy with what you have continue to fight continue to drive continue to grind because if you don't you're going to do what it is that you needed to. You're going to get to where you are now or where you want to be. And then you're going to be happy and just maintain that when you could do so much more with your life. And you could you know, tap into that potential and do so many more things than you possibly think that you ever could have. So, hey, look, I know that I, I, I said it, I, I plateaued or I plateaued. And for you that have plateaued also, look, get back out there reinvent what you're doing, reinvent who you are if you need to, challenge yourself in other ways, but you gotta be the one that pushes yourself to a new level. Uh, push yourself through and into a new chapter of your life. So I appreciate you watching, you know, decide and do 134. I appreciate every single one of you that have kind of went along with me on this journey of these videos. And we got a long way to go still. You know, 365 is a long way, but we're going to do it. I'm going to do it and I'm going to do it for every single one of you that are watching. And I'm going to do it for myself to ensure that I'm, I'm preaching to myself and the choir is singing as loud as possible. And I hear that every single day when I don't, that's when I tap into, you know, what motivates me, what gets me, dry, uh, you know, driving back on the right side of the road and continuing to charge in the direction that I know that I need to. So I appreciate it. Like, share, comment, feedback, you know, give it to me. I need it uh, just like anything else in the world. And I'd give it to you too. So till tomorrow, thanks for watching.